Did Lucy in the Sky lead to dead pets? Like how long? Did- it did. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I think you know all these are are ideas that you're pushing ahead to be like, wouldn't this be fun? Wouldn't this be fun? And then you just start to do it, and you see, can it work? And you know, M- Miley is a great powerful entity on her own, but she is influenced by her managers and people around her saying, you know, do you want to spend time doing this? Do you want to, do you really want to do this or whatever? And I, I understand that, you know, and, and it is a lot of, it's, you know, it's my agenda. I'm trying to make this stuff work. And, and I think everybody would trust that, it, you know, if Wayne's going to do this, he'll, he'll get it all together. And there's lots of, lots of roadblocks, you know, there's lots of things that are getting in the way there's 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 time there's there's money there's all these things that are getting in the way but by then i kind of felt like um you know she was miley was working a lot with mike will even even still then and i mean and those are great great days i mean i'm sitting in miley's studio at her house and the room is completely filled up with pot smoke and mike (laughs) will's been there for six hours and i'm sitting there with miley and mike will and we're making music i mean it's you know, if I, I, for me, I, I oftentimes would just be like, this is, this is insane, you know, and I'm, and I'm directing the songs. I mean, I guess for me, you know, it, it's, it, it, if it's not going to be like my thing, you don't want me involved. You know, it's like, get a real producer, get someone who knows what they're doing. But if it's my stuff, you know, I can, I can help you get all the way, everything about it I can help you with, you know, and, um, and and Miley is crazy. I mean, she's crazy in in the best way. And her and my wife are just like absolute best friends. And so, you know, there would never be a moment where, you know, she's dreading this. You know, they'd be out doing Molly in the swimming pool, and I'd say, Hey, hey, we're ready to go in here. Let's go in there and do a vocal. And she, what fucking song are we doing? And I'd, I'd we'd work it out, and she'd be in the studio for an hour, and then she'd go back to the pool and we'd mix it i mean it's it's insane yeah but i mean the spirit of that really is on the record and and so you know i mean miley makes a lot of music a lot of it's great but it's done by producers and stuff like that and this record doesn't sound like that and i didn't didn't want it to sound like that i wanted to sound like she's crazy and she's making this this music and i'm helping her and you know so for me i think that's the that's the great reward in the end is Oh man, we we really got it, you know. And and the, uh, I loved her her title, Miley Cyrus and the Dead Pets, because I mean, where a lot of the songs are based on when her dog died, and you know, people people can dismiss that, but you know, if you have a pet that matters that's been with you for years and years, and you sleep with them, and they travel with you, and they're just with you all the time, when when they when they die, it's it's devastating, mm-hmm. you know, and. We had dogs that had died around the same time and all that. And this idea that, you know, it's Miley Cyrus and the Dead Pets. I mean, this is just a great, great name of a group. You, you know what I mean? That would be a punk rock <laughs> totally. joke group, yes. you yeah. know. But it's like, no, this really is Miley Cyrus. But she's with the flaming lips. It's like, what? What is going on here? So it, it was it's amazing, you know. 